Hi everyone, it's Wendy here. I am very excited to shoot this uh, video because I'm gonna do a bill exchange and condensing all in one. Um, I said in a previous video, I think I want to uh, start using prop money for my savings challenges. And so that's what I'm here to do today. I want to exchange all of this money for prop money, put this money in the bank so it can start earning interest. Um, I got a bunch of this prop money from Budget with Nessa, so thank you so much, Nessa. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, let's start with some of my sinking funds here. I do want to put some of these in the bank as well, again, so that we're gaining interest. Um, so yeah, let's start. I hope I do this right. <laughs> this is my first time ever doing this. So we'll just see how it goes. Okay, so we already have 70 in the bank for emergency. Um, and then we have 20, 35 here. So I think, I feel like I need two cash trays. Um, I think I'm gonna keep the prop money in the cash tray and then just pile up the real money because I don't really think I'm going to condense the real money that much because it's pretty much all going to be prop money. Um, I hope that makes sense. I don't know. Uh, like I said, this is my first time, so I might change my mind halfway through. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so I need 35, but let's see, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, so let's see, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, so I have 105, so I could put these back and take 100 and then a $5 bill. Okay, so 105 in emergency. Debt, we have 50, 120, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 55, 255. So one, two, 20, 40, 55 in debt. That's gonna be a nice payment uh, towards a credit card or something pretty soon. Okay, tummy tuck, there's nothing in there. House, there's nothing in there. Oh wait, there's a 20 in there. Oh, you know what? Shoot, I should be writing this down, shouldn't I? So I know what goes in what bucket. Yeah, okay. Let me get a piece of paper here. See? Already forgetting to do things. Okay, so. Emergency, we had how much? Uh, 105. Debt was 255. One, two, 20, 40, yeah, 255 towards debt. House was 20 bucks. Okay, all right, perfect. Um, I have, I have 20 already in the bank for myself. Groceries has nothing. Medical, um, yeah, let's exchange this. So, medical. And I'm sorry if you can't see me writing. Um, it's probably cut off, but it's just, I'm just literally writing the amount that is in the fund. So, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70 in medical. So, 20, 40, 60 and 70. Car maintenance has 20. And I don't have um, 
all these buckets for all of these different funds, but that's okay. I'll just put them all. The ones that don't have buckets, I will put just in a, a main savings account. And then if I need to know how much goes towards what, I can reference my trackers. Um, if you're not familiar with Ally, that's the bank that I use. It's an all online bank. They don't have any physical branches. Um, and it is a high yield savings account. So right now the interest is at 3%. Um, and you can do buckets. I want to say you could do like up to maybe 10 or 12 buckets. So you can name them, you know, whatever you want, basically like a, an online sinking fund. Um, and then you can add money to, you know, your individual buckets. So it's pretty neat. Um, so anything that I don't have a bucket for on there, I will just add into that main savings. Okay. Um, for Penelope, I think I'm going to leave that. That's my dog um, because she has a groomer appointment next month and a checkup. Household has nothing. Clothing has nothing. Holidays, nothing. And then birthdays and gifting. I'm going to keep that as well. Um, this is my penny challenge. I definitely want to put that money in the bank because that is starting to add up. So let's grab that out. All right, so we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75. Uh, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Really? Not 199? 199. Um, okay, here's what I'm going to do. Watch this. I am going to steal a dollar from my one dollar challenge so I could just put 200 in here. One dollar. Okay. okay. I need to be like Elisha and get that sort quick. <laughs> All right. So 200 in the penny challenge. All right, that takes care of this binder. Let's move to the other sinking fund binder and see if there's anything in here that I want to exchange. Um, subscriptions, yep, I'll put that in. So we have five, six, seven, eight dollars towards subscriptions. off to the side there we go okay um amazon prime yes i'm gonna deposit that because i'm just gonna pay that online anyway when it's due 20 40 50 55 56 57 58 20 40 50 5 6 7 8 58 in Amazon Prime. And by the way, um, if you hear lullabies, that is my baby monitor as usual. So sorry for the background noise. Grab some more 20s here. Okay. Sewing. Um, yep. We'll do that. Sewing is $20, $40, So I guess I'm really not condensing as much as I'm just replacing. Uh, $20, $40, $50. 
I need some $50 bills. I'm set with prop money except for 50s, so maybe that'll be my next thing that I look for. Um, let's see what we have in vacay. About 50 in the bank. Uh, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 5, 6, 7, 8, 108 in vacay. 108. So 1, 5, 6, 7, 8. Beauty, I'm going to save because I am going to go to the spa next month, so um, I'll need cash for that. Bucks for boxes, let's cash that in. That's $40. $20, $40. I hope this video is not super boring. I feel like it probably is. <laughs> If it is, I'm very sorry. Um, I just, you know, figured I would film this, because why not? Okay, one month ahead, we got four bucks. So let's deposit that. One, two, three, four. Or one month ahead. Okay, and that's it for this binder. I am very excited to get all this money though in the bank because it's gonna be a nice chunk. And I only had about like 400 and some in the account. And I took out 200 because 200 of it was for Christmas. So <laughs> I barely have anything in there right now. So it will be nice to kind of replenish it. All right. So wild card. We have 10, 15, 16 dollars for a wild card. I probably should have written all of these categories ahead of time, but. You know me. All right, sixteen dollars in there. One K savings challenge is empty. Fifty envelope challenge. Twenty, forty, sixty, seventy, eighty. Okay, twenty, forty, sixty. 80. Today is Black Friday. I hope that everyone had a wonderful Thanksgiving if you celebrate. And if you went out shopping today, I hope you got some great deals. I was able to almost get my shopping completely done. So I'm very happy about that. Okay, scratch offs. We have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. $57 for scratch offs. 57, 20, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 56, 57. I just had no idea how many bills of each denomination I would need, so I just put a couple, but should have put it all. Okay, bingo. We have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 in bingo. 
and I just purchased a new binder because as I said in my last video this one is overflowing so I did get an A5 binder so some of these challenges are going to be moving over to that binder just to make some more room all right and my mini savings challenge from Tracy at Golden Girl Budgets I have ten dollars in there piecing the puzzle five bucks okay nothing in the 2023 yet all right, jar of hearts. I think this is kind of a big one. Let's see. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 45. I don't know why. My brain wasn't working. 145. Um, where are my hundreds? Here we go. 1, 20, 40, 5. Okay. Almost done. Puzzle challenge. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40. 80s and 90s challenge. 25, 35, 35 bucks. 20, 35. This one's from Stacy at Coffee and Budget. Go check out her Etsy shop. Okay, that one's nothing. I still owe $4 for this trick or treat. I, my last savings challenge video, I realized I had an IOU and I took the paper off and I never put the money in. I just continued playing the game and then never put the $4 in. So um, next time I play this, I owe it four bucks. Uh, but for right now we have 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 36 dollars in trick or treat. 36, 20, 30, 5, 6. Okay. And last but not least, jackpot savings. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26 dollars. 26 in jackpot. 25, 6. Okay. I feel like from now on I'm probably going to be using like a lot of prop money. I'm going to use real cash obviously for my cash envelopes, but other than that... I mean, there might be one or two sinking funds that I'll use real cash for, like my dog and the birthdays one, but yeah, I think it's going to be a lot of prop money uh, from now on, so we'll see. Okay, now comes the fun part where we get to count all this and see how much I'm putting in the bank. I always love when people like show their huge stack of money. Oh my God, this is so awesome to have a big fat stack like this 
just feels amazing. So if you're watching this video and you do not yet cash stuff, give it a try because yeah, like this is proof. So get on it. All right, let me sort all this money out and then we will give it a count. Okay. So, um, what I am going to do is use the calculator because I guarantee I will lose count if I don't. And I'm going to leave the 50 aside as well because I know I'll probably confuse myself. So, here we go. Okay. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 100, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2. I feel like this is like sticking together. Okay, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 100. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Yes, this is out of order in the cash tray. You might not even be able to see the cash tray. Okay, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20, 21, 22, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 29. 1299 dollars. Oh my gosh. $1,299. I couldn't get, like, I feel like taking another dollar out of the, <laughs> the $1 and uh, just to make it an even $1,300, but I won't. Wow. I'm rich. All right. So $1,299 is going back in the bank to gain some nice interest. I'm super excited about that. And that's all I have for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you are not currently subscribed, what are you waiting for? Click that button and follow me along in my journey. Like the video, leave a comment below. And until next time, bye budgeting fam.